we got this box in the mail yesterday and we ordered a solar fan for the sunroom and Bill is putting it together it's a like a double fan it really gets hot in here so through the winter uh, we want something to stir the air and we do use the heat from the sunroom um, by opening up our bedroom window it comes in the house so having this fan out there uh, be handy eventually it's a double fan and they don't have a lot of output but uh, all I want to do is move the air and uh, we, we've bought smaller ones like this before and it does it works good this is a solar panel uh, got a pretty long cord of a switch on it. It looks pretty well made. I think it's coming to a time where uh, more and more people are going to have to have greenhouses to grow stuff in the summertime. I do too. Uh, not, uh, not, not just the wintertime, but in the summertime too. And try to control the, yeah. the, the temperature and the humidity. Uh, that's, that's what we're going to try. But we'll see. Well, this weather is getting so crazy. You know, fans come up with uh, guards. Yeah, a little guard. Uh, this side here will be to the wood, uh, but it'll have openings in there for the fans uh, to, to pull in from the outside. And uh, this just protect your, where you won't stick your finger in. I don't know how anybody stick their finger up there. But. <laughs> It'll keep a bird from flying in too. Yeah, it would. Well, it'll just be inside. Yeah. Uh, I don't think they'll try to fly into it because there's a they can't see through it. They, our, our little kid might look at it and poke it if they really could reach it. Well, I mean, not all of them's going to be up high, but yeah, it is a little anyway, safeguard. That's what we're up to. Anyway, this kit it comes with a bunch of screws. You got to put it together. Yeah, it, it, This is the first thing that I've seen in a long time. Uh, ordered online, it comes with complete instructions. Real good instructions. Uh, I haven't seen this in years. Uh, it, it's I know the from common China. thing is to open the box and throw the instructions away. Yeah. <laughs> and then look at them later. And I usually do that. But uh, this has uh, got for a single fan instructions and for a dual fan instructions. And uh, it tells you uh, just exactly how to, uh, what size hole to cut and uh, real detail. It's, it, they, they really... Uh, do a good job. That kind of tell makes me think that if they went to that extent on instructions in these days, that it's probably a pretty quality thing. It had good and bad reviews on it. Uh, I think some people were expecting it to blow real hard, and I don't expect that. We do have a fan up in the attic that we use to to pull air, hot air from the sunroom into the house through the ductwork. We've never used it, we've never needed it. Uh, and it's got a thermostat control on it. And it's actually a regular attic fan. It's about that big and it really moves the air. But uh, I'm trying to get away from using electricity uh, and, seeing how, and seeing how the solar fan will work. Uh, and I'll, once we use it up all, we we'll, might give an update on it and I'll give the name of it. I'm not gonna give a review on it, the uh, brand until I see how it works. I, uh, I want to make sure it seems like yeah. last the one, the little single one that we bought, we've had it four or five years, I think. Yeah, it's worked real good. And it works real good. It, it's got a, uh, a switch on it, but uh, this, the thing I like about this bigger one, it's got a real long cord. So you can really, uh, uh, once you connect it, it's got a double connector here for each one for each fan. You can you take that solar fan and get it a long ways away from them. You can put it up outside, do it, you know, take your cord and put it through the wall, and uh, and putty it in. But uh, you, that way you got it straight above, but you got it a distance away from your fan. Uh, they give you plenty of cord to work with. Uh, I really like that. So if it if it holds up and seems like it's working good, I'll. I'll I'll come back and do an update and, and uh, give the name of it and about how much they cost. Uh, we got it on Amazon. Uh, 
but uh, I hope it works good. Uh, it seems like a good one. We'll, we'll see. We'll have a test run pretty soon. The sun is out, so it'll probably uh, get going. Yeah. I started turning before he got in the uh, sun. I'm holding it. Yeah, they blow a lot harder than I thought they were going. Let me hear the sound. Oh yeah, that's windy. Yeah. You face it right towards that sun. Yeah. Speeds it up. Yeah, but, oh, oh, dang. No. <laughs> you got to put the guards on the back. Yeah, there's guards. He got put on the back side. Yeah, this, either, either one of these single is more powerful than that other one we got. Let's we'll see how long they'll last. Oh, but I that, like that. That other one that we bought, a single one, is about four or five years old. And it still works good. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Is that about six feet? About six feet. I was, I was hoping to be longer than that, but that's probably as about as, for the voltage, that's about as far as I can go. Yeah. I think it's going to work good. And you can turn it off right, right there. Yeah. Then, uh, that's great. Well, I really like it and I can feel the air pretty good. So, it'll cool me off. And the sun's not out real bright because it's a little cloudy, but uh, it does work good. And for now, that's where I'm going to hang it under this rack. And it's aimed toward the windows where the hot sun comes in. Just to circulate some air in here. And, and it's quiet, so I really... Uh, like it so thanks for watching I appreciate it bye I put my little fan over here uh, get some airflow here and put the panel there by the window might as well use it until Bill takes it for uh, the pop can heater I really like this fan it's so cute it's just not as powerful as that other one. It's it's a uh, good enough for the pop can heater to you know bring in some air to that. This is our pop can heater, and we have a hole up there where the the heat comes through here into the house. So we'll put that in there and uh, get the airflow moving a little faster and it'll warm the, the front room down a lot better. This one has a, a solar panel right there. We open, this is our utility room, so we open that window during the day and we got a fan on the other side and pulls in the air and blows the hot air into the house. It works real good. This is in the utility room and here's that fan just like the other one. And uh, it works real good. It blows in the warm air into the house. 70 in here at the greenhouse and 75 in the sunroom.